across the portrait room and up the stairs oh we must be going the right way because I'm attacked well then whew. okay Are you done with us Probably not. Good grief. <sighs> All right. That was quite an event. And that's just a prologue. <laughs> up, 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 and more up. Ah, here it is. Back then. Now we're inside. Hmm. With nasty things to fight. I think it's time to get a little help there. Are you ready? Are you done? Ouch. Good grief. Whew. Well, let's try that. Good. What's on the other side of this door? I better. I hear a cat. I have a flame turret ready just in case. Cats. Cats all over the place. Yeah. Meow. Hmm. Oh, hello. Yikes. Oh, vampire spawn. Oh, wonderful. Okay. Yeah. Got it. Thank you. One more time. Ah! The witches. The withered forms of two hags glare at you from across their cauldron. One of them, the taller of the two, gestures for you to speak with her. Well, well, our master's guests have come back to the castle! The cat will be pleased to learn this. Once he returns... Uh, yes, I've returned. So, how can we be a service? Uh, uh, seen a raven about? The old witch's cackle, then one of them sneers at you. We know about your little babies. Baba Lysaga warned us of their spite. He set a trap. Just like that, if he flew. Face twisting into a gap tooth grin, the witch continues. Your little bird flappers now and dungeons with our elves. Soon, our secrets will be ours. Yeah, okay, you, you can help. Please. The girl's lingers on you, and she licks her lips. Such a different friend, you know, sister. I think you need more meat for our Hey, 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 please! I said please help me, you... Ah, I really need to Hey, it, thank you. Give me a heal spell, too. Give, give, give me a heal spell, please! Give me a heal spell, thank you. Oh... Stupid dancing bat. The cauldron's fiery heat abates. Good, thank goodness. Yeah, I need a protection from fire here. No! Get me out of 
Ah, that stupid thing! I hate the old person. <laughs> Whoever invented that spell? No, out of the stupid. Whoa. These vile clones have uttered their last curses. Oh, boy! It's time to search their lair. Yeah, good oh, grief. Well, revive Iron Defender. All right, let's take this up. Revive, please. Thank you. Whew. That was intense. Uh, you have anything left to? No, you don't. I suppose those shrines aren't really here, right? They're probably the shrines we were in earlier. Okay. Well, silver key. A bag. Opening the witch's pack reveals a dozen or so vials of milky white liquid and two crumpled notes. Right? Take the vials. You find a set of vials, which must be the potions of gaseous form described in the journal. They will allow you entry into the magical tower within the treasury. Alright, first note. Dear sisters, as many of you have heard, we have captured an unusual fellow trying to steal some of our potions. He is both man and raven, much as our friend Emil is both wolf and man. I'm keeping our new little bird in the south wing of the dungeons and plan on making him sing before our master returns. If any of you wish to join in on the fun, I left a spare key to the door on the table. Uh, Narcissa. Alright, looks like our friend is in the dungeons. This node is covered in alchemical formulas, but there are comments in the margins. Potion stability is still a problem. Why are the effects so brief? Must solve. Strange count effect. Potion will not work on subject again after first use. F find more test candidates. Uh, beside uh, Cirrus. Okay, dodgy potions, great. Just great. Yeah, fine. Hopefully, we serve some treasure after a lap. Uh, yeah, okay, not bad. Now, I need to find the Treasury's Magical Tower near the study on level 3. That means getting to level 3. Let's try the Rooms of Weeping now, since it does say we need to go to level 3. And hopefully this will lead to someplace useful. Everybody with us? Good. Broken furnishings lie scattered about the room. At the center of the destruction is the smashed remains of a moldering cake. Its sickly sweet smell permeates the wreckage. Something large but unseen suddenly moves through the air, smashing through furniture like it was paper. It is circling you. It's a white tornado! Uh, you into everything? Well, that's so much for the white tornado. No. Let's see if we can find this magical tower we're supposed to be seeking. I think this is the way to the study. Aha! Yes, I remember this place. And there's the fire. Right? Is it? Is it this? I was thinking it was the treasury behind the fire that we needed to find. Hmm. Right? That would make sense because I think that's where we found the icon of Ravenloft or something like. Oh, hold on. There, there's the magic door there. Pile of gold. Ooh, gold. 
We won't argue with that. And three levels of magic doors. Here's the next door. Oh, hello. Uh, uh, not too many friends, though. Nasty things, undead things. Forsaken raid, as opposed to a nice, normal, everyday you'll meet on the street raid. Yeah. Ah. <sighs> Done. Next one here. Oh. A nice rest spot. Okay. And the tower door. So this is where we'll find a raven? Hmm. I hope so. The tower stands impassable. Use the Hag Potion of Gaseous Form to pass through. Okay. You quaff the witch's brew, and you watch as your body evaporates into a fine mist. By strength of will alone, you push yourself through the tiny tower window and take solid form again on the inside. The tower seems to be bigger on the inside somehow. And as promised, it is filled with treasure. The flood of heavy footsteps coming from above serves as a warning that it does not lack for guards. Okay, so it's a TARDIS room. A TARDIS tower, that's it. A TARDIS tower. Uh, we'll take care of the TARDIS tower. Uh, actually, we'll take care of the golems first, yes. There you go, that's a one set. Are, are we done? Whew! Well then. Yeah, treasure. That's treasure. Treasure? Is there a raven beneath all this treasure? More treasure? Alright, now... Now that we had that little... Diversion. Upstairs. Alright. Perhaps aggressive wasn't the right mode for that. I do see a book there. And a chest. We open up the chest. What's in the book? The Tome of Strahd. This book's pages are brittle with age, and much of it is illegible. But what you can make out suggests the author is none other than Strahd himself. Perhaps your allies back in town can make sense of it. I can make sense of this chest. Woo! All right. Oh, pick up visit tells her we'll bind it to you. Yeah, I'll take that. But. Oh. Oh, getting yes for the Raven out of the dungeons was an optional. Oh. I'm only allowed in here once, right? Hmm. I wonder if I can get to him. Ah, the way to the dungeons. It's stink here. And dangerous, apparently. Oh, you are kidding me. Well, let's take care of these teleportation traps. Good. Teleportation traps. Actually, I think I remember having to do this quest once on the my paladin where I was constantly okay move more slowly
Yeah. Yeah, they... Ouch, 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 ouch. I can see why this part is optional. Oh boy! <laughs> I'm beginning to wonder if I've managed to finish this on my paladin. Hmm. Okay, now. Whatever that does. I need to get back to the main room. Well, I also need to survive whatever is going on in here. They're ignoring me. Oh, well, of course they're incorporeal, so they're not going to be easy to kill. <sighs> this is going to take some time. This time, more carefully so that we don't stumble into another one of these traps because they seem to be all over the place good grief now oh yeah I remember this place I was thinking I could avoid coming down here but apparently if you want the raven this is where you go Now, where can I find one bird? Hmm. Well, doesn't seem very promising if you ask me. Not in the least. It was into the big room, so what about this room? Hmm. I'm sure there'll be more of these teleportation traps in here, too. Or not. Hey, is there a raven? Eh. Hold on. I don't know if that could be Jasper. No, it's Emil Tunukin. No, whoever that is. I'm looking for a yes. Right. Right. Anyone in there? There's a chest in there, and that thing looks nasty. It looks like a hag. <sighs> what is he? Hold on, there's a sister of Strad here, and... Oh, that is a raven! Okay! This is the right place. Hello! The hag turns with a crooked smile as you enter the room. The raven captive calls, It's a trap! And you hear the heavy clank of iron doors behind you. The hag cries out with glee. My lord, they came for the bell just as you said. Now... Make me a vessel of your wrath. Vanquish them through me. The air becomes smothering, and the old woman's eyes suddenly gleam with a wicked light. She speaks in a voice that is altered, terrible. Your request is granted, sir. Now, let us see who our ear man Okay. Thought I was done for. Really did. Thank you so much. I thought I was doomed. Uh, you're welcome. Anyway, uh, we should all get out of here. Strahd will return soon, and I, for one, do not want to be here when it happens. I wish I had had a chance to see what was inside that tower, but I don't think it's worth the risk. Not anymore. Uh, I've already been there. Found this book. Interesting. Is this a diary of Strahd's? 
Oh dear, I must not get distracted. Uh, take it back to my mother and we'll figure out what it means. But now, I must fly from this place. Farewell. Jesper bobs his feathered head in one last gesture of appreciation, then takes flight to find the nearest window. Right, and I'm out of here. I am back. By Mother Night, you have returned. While I waited, I feared Jesper was lost and I had sent you into your doom as well. Thank you. Well then, what have you got here? Hopefully something useful. Something, well, maybe it'll be useful in a level. Oh, a repeating heavy crossbow of feeding plus four? Well, I don't know how it'll do compared to the one I currently have. I'll try it and see, but most likely it'll be after Ravenloft where I'll use that. And I think uh, that's it for today's episode. Next time, we'll see what we'll see what we have to do next. But I have a feeling we'll be attending a tea party in the next episode of Honey Plays the Dragonborn.